The Three Stages of Leo Every zodiac sign has three forms to it. We all start off as the first form of the sign, and those forms are representative of all 12 signs. For example, the Ram for Aries, Lion for Leo, and Centaur for Sagittarius. But there are two more forms to each sign, and these are lesser known. For Leo, these three forms are the Lion, the Warrior, and the King. Lion This is the most basic form of a Leo, and this form is most known and most tied to pride. In this stage of their evolution, Leos are struggling with hard lessons that pride draws into their gravitational field. Just like the sun's shine is the absolute light on our planet, so is pride the absolute feeling for Leos in their first form. Pride overpowers all other feelings, and Leos are very self-destructive in this stage, as they allow for the smallest of things to trigger their pride, thus triggering their self-destructive behavior patterns that lead to their ultimate demise through unhappiness and loneliness. Though it is true that they learn how to be centered and confident in this stage, they also lack the capacity to recognize when their feelings of pride are rightfully wounded and when they're blowing things out of proportion just because pride is the most familiar feeling they've become accustomed to at this stage. Rage is their venom in this stage of evolution, and they're too easily set off if they feel that their authority is threatened. This is when they're forced to evolve into a warrior. Warrior This form is their shining, fierce form. In this form, their armor is their own shining, bright light given to them by the sun itself. In this stage of their evolution, Leos encounter lessons in people who test their authority, self-confidence, faith in themselves, and faith in right and wrong. This is the form where they learn not to fight for themselves, but also for the weak. In this form, Leos are given the opportunity to become the hero of the people. They become the defendants of the poor and wounded. Leos are given a chance to experience higher truth and a higher calling. It's in this form that they learn how to become not just plain warriors, but also heroes. They're forced to look at their own weak spots and fears directly in the eye, those of becoming less and fading out of importance and existence. They must evolve in order to overcome themselves, and the biggest lesson in this stage of their evolution is learned through selflessness. King This is their ultimate and final form, the king. In this stage, Leos overtake the golden crown of the king of the jungle that they have fought tooth and nail to earn. And they did earn it. They became the king only once they'd mastered the lessons of humbleness and selflessness. For a true king doesn't rule over others for himself. He rules because he's the wisest and most just of them all. He doesn't have his kingdom. The kingdom has him in its service. And this is true for all Leos who make it this far. They are the embodiment of just power shining guidance and eternal hope for others. In this form, Leos learn what it's like to have such overpowering responsibility on their shoulders that they can bear that crown only through immense personal power and strength. This final form is the form that tests their mettle of what they're made of. Do they have what it takes to wear that heavy crown and be both the safety net and legs to the table of their family, subordinates, and the entire kingdom? Thank you for watching the video. Please like, share, and subscribe to get all the updates.